Arlington Improv, how's it going? All right. All right. I got my first piece of ass in college. It was my professor. She had what had to be the biggest dick I've ever seen. So I'm going to be telling some jokes. Uh, first, I want to get right with the Lord. Oh, hold on, this won't take long. Uh, God, grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things I can. And please, please let me get some pussy. Okay. All right, I'm ready. I think it's going to be a good set. Tonight, it's Arlington Improv. Tomorrow, I get slapped by Will Smith. My career has taken off. I know something's going to happen. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to try some uh, new stuff. Uh, I still fuck with my ex-girlfriend a little bit on the phone. you know. And uh, She said, talk to me like lovers do. I said, okay, bend over. She got pissed. I'm a lady. Be a gentleman. Okay, please bend over. See, I'm not the same guy in a friendship that I am in a relationship. When I'm in a friendship with a woman, I'm respectful, I'm polite, boundaries are healthy. But when I'm in a relationship, I got expectations and things can get ugly. It happened last week. We got into it. I said, get your shit and get the fuck out of my house. She said, this is my house. <laughs> See, these are jokes, what I'm doing for you guys. Okay. Um, oh, shit. Yeah. Loneliness is a terrible thing. Um, but there are things you can do to get on lonely. There's interconnectedness. There's reaching out, being social. But I prefer prostitution. Okay. Take that one little laugh from the cute girl on the left. All right. Saw a license plate that said, Massachusetts, the spirit of America. That was interesting. I learned something, because I thought the spirit of America was Jack Daniel. I like telling alcoholic jokes. I got six years of sobriety right now. Thank you. Based on the way this set's going, I think I'm going to start drinking again. Oh, I'll start with the no duels and uh, just work my way up to crown. Yeah. I know what I'm talking about. I thought I was a sexaholic, but the pussy got in the way of my drinking. <laughs> I knew I was an alcoholic because in 2016 I came home and there was a yellow piece of paper on my door that said eviction notice. <sighs> what the fuck? I just paid the rent six months ago. <laughs> I feel like, am I too deep for you all of a sudden? Like, <laughs> so, yeah, sometimes I miss using drugs. I'd like to go to the dope house and say, hey man, <laughs> you give me the dope, you keep the consequences. I'm not. <laughs> you guys are starting to come alive. I like you a little bit more now. You know, my chiropractor's right over here on Matlock Road. Uh, oh, I should tell you, I got rejected by a female. Which is weird, because I didn't even ask her out. Man, um, I'm trying to work with you guys. I really am. So I went to this chiropractor. He's, he knows I'm single. He says, well, you know, I'm fixing to be single, too. What are you talking about, Doc? He says, well, my daughter went on my wife's Snapchat. Turns out she's been fucking this other guy for our whole marriage. And I was surprised, because I've only been fucking her a couple weeks. How are two hoes going to make it in a relationship? You can't make a hoe a housewife. We all know that. But guess what? You can't make a hoe a house husband either. Still working on that one. Fuck you guys. This is well thought out. So a lot of a lot of these redneck white dudes are naming their daughters after GMC trucks. You know that, right? So there's a lot of chicks out there named Sierra and Denali. They think it's pretty, right? But I'm classy. I named my daughter F-150. <laughs> Went to Central Market. Uh, cashier bumped into me. She goes, oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. Don't worry about it, ma'am. That's the most action I've had all week. See, these are lonely middle-aged man jokes I'm doing for you right now. Okay. Went to Target to get some new glasses. Uh, they, they fucked up the order. Anyway, I was walking out, and uh, this chick in front of me yells to another girl, like your outfit! I'm trying to remember the last time a chick told me she liked my outfit. Fuck. Just one more reason. 
to Turn Lesbo. Hey, did you guys have a good time? I'm Ryan. Thanks. <laughs>